So today guys we check out what in my opinion is the most powerful assault rifle in this game. Now I recently made a top 5 assault rifles, this was not a part of them, it should have been, no doubt about it. Issue is, I've only just had it drop myself as it's quite rare. The weapon many many people look over but today we will check it out. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and today I bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you want to see more. Okay, so the weapon in question today is an epic assault rifle called the Cost Effective Optimized Q System. This epic assault rifle being an Atlas weapon is beyond anything I've experienced damage wise from any other assault rifle in this game. Now in this game I believe we have two legendary assault rifles coming from Atlas, both are pretty bad though in my opinion, the optimized carrier and the rebel yell. These I've seen and used more than enough to know Atlas assault rifles ain't that great at all and I feel this may be the reason many people overlook Atlas assault rifles of any rarity variant, which to be honest I think I'm guilty of myself. Now because I know there are epic and rare weapons in this game which offer a lot more than those are legendaries, I sometimes make it a habit of loading in and out of sanctuary checking crazy hills, iridium vending machine for certain weapons which I sometimes know appear which can surprise you. So I did this for about 30 minutes and then I came across this weapon, the cost effective optimized Q system. When I checked out its stats, I was seriously surprised by what this thing offered. As you can see, 883 damage times 2. Damage bonus is applied. But what intrigued me most about this weapon was the fact it was a 2 times variant. But it didn't consume 2 ammo per shot, which is super rare. So instead of actually buying this, and in my opinion wasting what could be 800 iridium, I decided to do a little research on this weapon. So I jumped onto Google. Wrote in cost effective optimized Q system. And I came across a couple of posts on Reddit and a few Borderlands forums where people were actually talking about calling for a nerf for this weapon, which I didn't and don't understand such ideas. An OP weapon within Borderlands isn't like it is within other games. It doesn't affect anyone or anything in reality. This isn't destiny, people. So, yeah, a few posts I saw literally people going crazy over this weapon, saying it's too powerful. How is it this powerful? It needs a nerf, this, that, and the other. So I jumped on my discord and asked there, I asked if anybody has this weapon and I came across a couple of epic people who helped me out with this weapon. So shout out to Dark Satans for this variant you can see on the screen now which is absolutely great. But a massive shout out to my pal Steve-O for sending me this variant which is perfect for my Winter Soldier build. Steve-O is an admin to a great Xbox Borderlands 3 society upon discord, willing to help anybody out. You will find that Discord linked within the video description which I do recommend you do checking out. So this variant even better, 1084 times 2 with the Sentinel Anointment also, 28 in a mag as well, just amazing. Plus 47% weapon damage, plus 21% fire rate, plus 19% reload speed with the best sight this weapon can have of a 1.5 times zoom. So using this weapon on Mayhem for within a slot shaft it just utterly mounts everything within its path. Now yes the build I'm using is great and yes that helps out, but at the end of the day using this weapon within this build and comparing it to other weapons I'm using within this build such as the redistributor, the dastardly Maggie, the cutsman, so many others, I will tell you guys this thing is on par, if not more powerful than some of these weapons and as crazy as it sounds people it's the truth. I mean my first time using this I was actually in shock of how powerful this thing is. I mean it doesn't offer any form of elemental benefits unless it's anointment is applied like mine but even still guys it's crazy as you can see by the footage on the screen now. So the weapon itself it normally comes with a scope which doesn't make it that efficient in all instances but if you do land a 1.5 times sight like the one I have it's a different weapon altogether. It shoots smart bullets but it also has an alternate mode being a tracker grenade I and mean, we all know how that works. And although it's pretty useful, it isn't all that necessary. So the Q system, this Atlas Epic Assault Rifle, it's a must get in my opinion people. Now this weapon is a world drop, I've seen it a couple of times within Earl's Avenging Machine, I've seen it drop within the slaughter shaft like the one you can see on the screen now, this one even more powerful than the one I was sent to me by Steve O, and it also has a decent anointment too, the problem with this one is though it's got that crazy sight on it. I've also seen this thing drop at Grave Ward and a few other places people, so check those purples. Make sure you ain't leaving monsters like this on the floor. It's a must get in my opinion. And on a serious note, this thing is stupid powerful guys. Stupid powerful. Over 2000 damage per shot. 
compare that to anything else which isn't a heavy or a sniper in this game and I'll be super surprised if you find anything unpassed that wipes. So yeah guys, the cost effective optimized Q system is an incredible Atlas epic assault rifle, one that should not be overlooked. Now before we go, join my Discord linked within the video description where you can chat with hundreds of other Borderlands 3 fans, trade with many many folks and there too. That is linked within the video description. But on that note guys, I am out. If you guys enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one. Fire at will, little bud!
Cranky gets! Some work drone! 